So first I'm starting off with my LA Girl Pro Concealer Green Corrector around my nose. That is going to correct the redness that I have around my nose and even out that skin tone. Then I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Cream Contour Palette in the color Coral and I'm putting it on my cheeks and around my chin for the dark spots that I have in that spot. That is going to even out my skin tone when I put on my foundation. Next, I'm taking my Eco 2 Stippling Tool Brush and I'm just blending out those color corrected areas. As you can see, I'm using a patting motion around my nose and then I'm going to use that same patting motion around my cheeks and around my chin just to make sure I have that evenly spread for when I put on my foundation. Next, I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Matte in the color 330 Toffee Caramel. And I'm just, of course, applying my foundation with my Beauty Blender all around, making sure that I spread the product down my neckline, making sure that I spread the product evenly, and just using continuous patting motions in my face to apply my foundation. Then I'm taking my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Warm Sand. And I'm applying that to my highlight areas and smoothing that product out. taking my MAC mineralized skin finish medium tan powder and I'm just applying it all over my face to set my foundation and my concealer highlights then I'm taking my wet n wild color con bronzer and I'm sorry you guys I really do apologize I do not remember the name of this bronzer I've had this bronzer for so long and I've used it for so long and it's absolutely one of my favorites but I will try to find it and list it in the description box below for you guys. Next, I'm going to take my Maybelline Color Tattoo Pure Pigments in the color Buff and Tough and apply that to the upper crease of my lid. Next, I'm going to take this NYX eyeshadow trio that I got from Ipsy and I'm taking that copper color and I'm applying that to kind of like the back part of my lid and going just slightly into the middle. I'm using an e.l.f. black blending brush to apply this. With the shimmer color that is provided, I'm going to take my flat brush, spray it with setting spray to illuminate that color and I'm going to apply that to the front of my lid. Then to fuse all of those colors together, I'm just going to take a blending brush again and blend all of those colors together in my lid. Then I'm taking that dark blackish color and I'm going to apply that to the end of my crease to smoke out my eye. And I'm also using a crease brush to apply this. Taking that black blending brush again, I'm just blending out that blackish brownish color into the lid to give me that true natural looking smoky eye. Last but not least, I'm taking my Wet n Wild lip pencil in the color Simba Brown and I'm applying that to my lips. Then I'm applying my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Stockholm. 
and that's going to give me kind of like that natural looking neutral lip that I'm looking for today and that's going to make me an Instagram baddie y'all this is what makes your Instagram baddie all natural and you see a girl she has finished the look this is the final look I hope that you all love this look as much as I do I'd like to thank everybody for tuning into my page once again if this is your first time watching i do appreciate you viewing my page please 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 don't forget to give this page and this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like follow me on instagram follow me on snapchat i thank all of you guys again for tuning into my page once again i love you guys thank you for the suggestions make sure to comment below as well 